Hello everyone, my name is Jack Sorrell and today I'm going to show you how to homebrew your Wii U on firmware version 5.5.2. Homebrewing your Wii U is the first step to unlocking your console's full potential. With homebrew, you can install emulators, mods for games as well as tools and loads more. And it should only take 5 minutes, even if you have no experience with homebrew. But if you do need some help, or just want to talk about homebrew, you can join my Discord server, the link is in the description. So now, let's get started, and remember to leave a like on this video if it helped you out. The first thing you have to do is click the link below named Homebrew Files, then on the website, download the Homebrew Launcher. Extract the homebrew file zip folder to your desktop, then copy the Wii U folder to the root of your Wii U's SD card. Your SD card shouldn't be as messy as mine is. Now eject the SD card and delete the remaining homebrew files from your computer. Then put the SD card back into your Wii U while it's turned off, then turn it on. Once your Wii U is turned on, open up the internet browser. In the URL bar, type in loadin.ovh. The spelling's on the screen now. Remember to bookmark the website so you can open it faster next time. When the website loads, select this exploit from the drop down menu. This one is the most reliable and works on 5.5.2. Now all you have to do is hit that submit button and the exploit will start doing its thing and hopefully the homebrew launcher will open. And you can see, on my first try it worked. Sometimes your Wii U can freeze and you'll be stuck on the internet browser screen. Let's go over what to do if this happens to you and how to try again. Just hold down the power button on the Wii U console for about 5 seconds. This will force the Wii U to power off even if it's frozen. To run the exploit again, open up the internet browser and before the page loads, hit the stop button. If you don't stop the page from loading quick enough, your Wii U will probably freeze. Now open the bookmark you made earlier and run the same exploit as you did last time. If the homebrew launcher doesn't open on your second try or your third try, make sure you have the correct files on your SD card. Or maybe you just haven't gotten lucky and it failed both times. Usually, this works for me one out of three times. And that's it, you've homebrewed your Wii U on firmware version 5.5.2. If you don't see any apps in your homebrew launcher, it's because you have to install them. I have some videos linked below showing you how to install some homebrew apps. Well, that's all for today. My name is Jack Sorrell and I'll see you next Sunday with a brand new video. If you have an idea for a future video, leave it in the comment section below and I'll feature your channel in the video if your idea gets chosen.